It's that Z, Zubo, no, she my flow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Welcome back, everybody, to Go Crash Valley PC Edition here on Mr. Blue Farms. Folks, we are over here on field 29, and I hate to do this. It is potatoes, potatoes, no. 45814 It's going to help us get us out of debt because we're $85,314 in debt. It's going to give us $45,814. <sighs> Things we got to do to get out of debt, folks. Sometimes we just got to stop what we're doing and go to work. I know, right? Work can be very stressful sometimes. That's why I'm glad I like my work, making videos for y'all. It's not work if you love what you're doing, right? Well, sometimes this can get stressful, too. Not trying to say anything, folks, but yeah. It can get very stressful trying to figure out what to record next. So, I figure we ain't done some missions in a long time. So, we gonna make some, or do some missions. Not make them, but do them. Yeah, right here on Mr. Blue Farms. So stay tuned. I wish I looked that good in person. Ha! Anyway. My phone over here going off for a call from New Jersey. Boy, wouldn't that be something that was from Lance Sturt and I didn't know. I'd been so mad. Watch his vlog today and then be like, Well, we tried to call Mr. Blue Farms, a.k.a. Tommy Miller, but he wouldn't answer his phone. So he missed a shout out. <gasps> what? I just just kidding, folks. That probably won't happen. But hey, you never know, right? You never know. What am I doing? I'm sitting here driving this thing and getting all crazy and everything else. Thinking about Lance. Anyway, uh, let's see. We're gonna that bad about right. I don't think the Oh, auto save mod, you, you scared me. All right, there we go. I'm going to turn that on. Got the satellite track of me. Supposed to make a turn that way. Let's let's see if it's going to do it. Let's just see if it's going to do it. Folks, am I too loud? I hope I ain't too loud. Uh, thing on. Ah, it didn't do it. It didn't do it. Okay. Okay, I have to do this myself then. We're going to take a couple turns here. Control W and number three button. One and two changes your speed over. We well, can see the bottom right corner where it says number, or says 26 right there. Over to the right of the green tractor there. One and true controls that you see there I can take it down to 20 I can bring it up to my max speed which is 26 uh, the three right beside that controls the uh, cruise uh, speed you know like you're going down the road in the car and you set your cruise control that's what number three does so yeah well, folks, this is going to take me a while. I don't think it'll take the full 100 minutes. It usually don't, but I'm just going to keep going in a circle, go back over there, back over here, back over there, back over here till I get out of these long rows. Then uh, probably just do circles and the short ones there. But, folks, I hope you uh going to like this episode. I got more in this mission, so I'm going to do this mission. And hopefully a mission on that fail. Try to get me out of debt a little bit. Because I do want to buy something for y'all. We're going to change up our baler. we got some spraying to do. Some planting to do. Uh, of course you already know about the missions. And um, I don't know what else. we got some other stuff to do. Oh the pallet maker. <laughs> I want to show y'all something that it does too. So, uh, 
Stand by for that here on Mr. Blue Farms. All right, folks, I will be right back. All right, folks, I'm mad. I am mad. As you can see, I'm harvesting, right? All right, as you can see, look at the top right corner up there, the black circle. You got the time, 106, and the seconds count down, like 20. 21, 20, 19. That circle is not getting green. It should have done showed a piece of green. This mission's not working. Look at your bottom right corner. Right there, my fuel gauge. See, I got 1125 in fuel liters. See right there, it says zero under that. I am not filling up with sugar beets or potatoes. One, one thing, this is a sugar beet harvester. Might have a potato head on it, but it's sugar beet harvester. But this mission is not working. It's not working whatsoever. So, okay. All right, here we go. This is the first time I ever had problems on this map of doing this. Mission failed. Give me the same, exact same, same. Same machine. Let's start it again. See if it'll work this time. We'll know right off the back here. All right, first I need to unfold. Uh, machines unfolded. There we go. It turned on that time. All right, same thing. I'm harvesting, but it's not giving me nothing for it. All right, so we're just gonna have to. Uh, let me tap around here. I'm gonna show y'all this. This the uh, pallet maker machine. Oh man. All right, mission failed. Go back to the pallet machine. Those the PFS 16,000. It's what we use to make the wood chips with, remember? Well, I made some pig food. Last episode, after I ended it, I brought it over here to try some pig food. And it, and, uh, it took it, but it never would make a pallet. So I'm like, oh, great. Now I'm stuck with pig food in it. So I just ended it, saved it, ended it and stuff, and uh, I started it up today, and uh, it worked. So it does make pig food. I know it's supposed to make everything. Now as you can see there, it's 200,000 liters. 200,000 liters. And 666 liters. I don't know how that happened, folks, but... uh. Yeah, y'all, uh, whatever it's called, uh, paranormal activity, 666, that would be the palette to, to use for it. So, uh, let's carry this over here. Uh, I got the muscle mod on, I know, I'm sorry. Some like it, some don't. I love it, and I'm going to keep using it. I know it's unrealistic. Oh, my God, I need to come over here and clean um, how much food they got? Alright, so they're going to need some corn because all oh, it's on the ground. As you can see, it took that whole thing. And yes, I need to go clean my eggs. And this would have to be the original Kentucky truck. Okay. Um, we're up here by 
field one and six, which is if you get out and look down the mountain. Well, yeah, right there's the wood mill, saw mill. I'm going to clear these trees off right here because I got some fans for them. And is this the, yeah, this is the other original. Well, I'm going to clear these trees off on this hill here because I got fans for this hill. We're getting a windmill sooner or later. Yeah. Hopefully sooner than later. But, um, all right. I done this for a reason too, folks. As you, you can see up there, uh, you got the Geno 150. You got it twice. Then you got me that's in this tractor. Then we got another tractor that says Fertilize 66. Wow, there's a lot of 60s today. But anyway, we're going to hook up. And as you can see now, I, okay, we have another icon on the uh, inspector mod there. If you detach your equipment, I think everything is still set up. Let's, uh, ah, everything's off. Plant growth. See, this is what I'm talking about. Plant growth needs to be on. It's always off. When I save a game, come back on, plant growth is always off. Either that or the fertilizer be on. See, fast off on three. That should be it. I hope. Maybe that's why we couldn't do it mission because the plant growth was off. Don't know. Okay, I need to go collect my eggs. We need to buy a, a, a Juno for the pigs area. Sheeps are doing good. What's up, Mr. Blue? Huh? What? Well, hello there, Queen Sheep. How you doing? Me, not much. Ah, that's nice to hear. All right, well, I hate to run. What? Ah, me. Look at that hay. It's delicious. Thank you. Oh, oh, well, thank you. All right, well, I got to go, Queen Sheep. Got a lot of stuff to do this episode. See you later, Mr. Blue. That's for sure. Because you feed me good. Alright, bye you too. Queen Sheep, she's always so nice. Oh, I to go over here and see how many wool pallets we got. She needs to hurry up and get us some wool pallets. Oh, we got a couple. Got two there. Uh, too bad it wouldn't give us the price. But anyway, um, we got to get some things started here. Um, don't know what I'm doing fit down here. It should be a fair field one for wood chips. Um, there we go. This is one of the things I want to trade in, folks. But I don't have enough money right now to do it. I don't know if I was making sandwich bells or straw bells. I like it should be straw bells. But we'll find out here in a minute, won't we? We gotta finish getting this up so we can yeah, get these fields worked up. Um, hello, what's happening, what's happening, there's not a bell in there, there's Sean, I'm loaded at 4,000, folks, you see how laggy it is? Oh my god. Ah, right, we just lost us a bell and baler. I'm pretty sure it's that baler. 
All right, see how much faster it got? Uh, uh, this is it's that Beller. Oh, well. Um, okay, I don't know what to do now, folks. I guess I'm on a uh, finish wind rolling this here, and I'm going to take that Baylor to the market shop. There's no use of having something we can't use. Um, I don't know if I got a forklift tractor down here or not. But anyway, let me uh, finish this out to the end. I'm going to grab that baler, take it to the market shop, and I'll meet y'all there. All right, folks. This is part three. And y'all just saw part one. Part two. Um, I got it in the tractor. Hooked back up to the hay baler. Went down to... I got on the highway, went towards the market shop, but I probably got to feel 22, 23, somewhere there on the main road and saw the biggest rubber band effect in my life. Now, rubber band effect is, um, well, you take the tongue here and the PTO, which is not showing right now because it's not hooked up to the tractor. I'm not going to hook it up. But rubber band is when just like a rubber band when it stretches you pull a rubber band as far as it'll stretch okay well that's what the tongue and the dry shaft done this baler is something wrong with it there is no bell in it whatsoever as you can see even when i hook up to it it shows four thousand liters and it starts bugging everything out Okay, it started rubber banding, got real slow down there towards field 22. So I sold the baler. As you can see, it's still here. So, but that was hooked up to the tractor when I sold it. I stopped right in the middle of the road, sold it because I couldn't go no further. It slowed down to like one mile an hour and it looked like a big long rubber band stretched out in between the tractor and the baler. So I figure I'd record it because y'all probably wouldn't believe me. Now, I didn't record that right ago, but I'm going to record it now and see what it does to show y'all. Okay, sell. So, yes, come on. Okay, it's sold. I don't have it no more. And, um,. Uh, Back. Okay. Y'all just see me sell, sell, sold it, right? Look at look at the screen. Look at it. I barely can move. I barely can move, folks. Oh my god. Okay, I cannot go back into the shop. I can't hit my start button. I go see if I can get in the tractor. I cannot even get into the tractor. Okay. So I can't go. I cannot go back into my shop menu to sell stuff to show it's there i can't go in the start menu i go over here see if i can go over to this tractor look how slow i even got the speed button down No, I can't go on that. All right. Hitting F1. It's not doing nothing. Hide my 
ain't, ain't nothing. Right clicking so I bring up the course play or anything. It's not doing that. I don't want to take up all the time on this. But one other thing I know to do, folks, is just to go back out again and take away that mod before I even start the game. I'm going to, well, where am I going? Eggs back this way. I want to see if I can collect some eggs. I'm on. All right, apparently I collected the egg. Did not show it. Y'all see where the screen is moving? I don't know, folks. I can't save the game because I can't go into the start menu. None of my buttons are working. See, nine toggles the map. It's not even toggling the, the map or anything. None of these buttons are letting me go anywhere. So, uh, Alright, I'm back folks. Uh, this is the Gold Crest Valley. The save game that I didn't get to save again. As you can see, we're still down to 87. But I just want to show this to y'all. Maybe there's somebody out there that can help me. Now, the Coon DLC, which is right here. I got thinking... If I uncheck this, not only is it going to take away the coon um, baler, it's also going to take away the coon sprayer, uh, whatever else I got that's coon. So, I got thinking, I added this. The AAA Universal Processing Kit. I'm deleting, or not deleting it, but I'm unchecking it for now. And I also added these two here before I started. And I added several more. Now, these two I need to find. I cannot find them in my mods folder. They're not named this. They're named something else. So I'm going to have to figure out what their names are and get them out of there. But uh, I also added this here. Taking the battle tractor away. Um, I'm going to take the, all these right here away for right now. Also, uh, I have some other things here I need to take away. I don't have a sprayer add-on this time, but uh, yeah. So we're going to try this right here and see if that makes a difference. And uh, yeah, it'll just take a few seconds, folks, and it should load here. I'm going to fast forward. All right, folks, that took a little bit, but here we go. I'm just going to walk around over here. And uh, see what we got now. Okay, still no bell in there. I am not going to attach to this. I'm just going to go and sell this thing as fast as I can. Because our other module install is going to need the processing kit in order for it to work. So see, we got the coon spray, 
uh, dry fertilizer buggy, the sprayer, and the baler. So, okay, let's see if that worked. Come on. Oh, folks, it didn't work. What am I going to do? It's right back to the same way. Let's see if I can get into a vehicle. Nothing. All right, folks, I will be right back. I'm going to restart it again. And then uh, one thing I know to do is to try to drive it back to the store. Try to sell it there. It's the only other thing I know. But all right, I'll be right back. All right, everybody. It is currently the next day for me. Um, I got some bad news. As you can see, the baler is gone. I had to get rid of it. It's having a lot of problems. Unfortunately, the only way I get rid of it, I could not sell it, folks. I could not sell it. I kept on trying a bunch of stuff. I took away some of the other mods, the processing, universal processing kit. I took it out. Tried a bunch of stuff before I took the coon pack out. Took the coon pack completely out is the only way I could get rid of it. I, I took the baler. I tried to go around the highway, got to field 22, it stopped, it started bugging out, crashed the game, wouldn't let me save it, nothing, so it brought me right back where I was at. Tried to sell it directly, it would not sell, it sold it, showed it to sell, but it didn't give me the money for it, and it never did disappear, it kept on staying there, saying it was fully loaded. With 4,000 liters of straw in it, ready to wrap. But it didn't. I hooked into it this morning, made a beeline across this hill there, made a pretty good jump, made it to the market shop, got it on the selling point, sold it, and guess what? Still nothing. It was sitting right there when I come back out of the street. Wouldn't give me the money for it, wouldn't disappear. So I'm like, there's only thing, one thing left to do. And as you see here, it hurt us. For y'all that don't know, this, well, you can see right here. Right here, it lines up with the tractor here. All this has been sprayed with the coon pack. I had, uh, for y'all that's just now tuning in, I had a coon sprayer on the front. And a coon, well, not sprayer, had a coon tank on the front and a coon sprayer on the back. Okay. Well, now we don't have that. We're going to have to find out something else to do. I'm 87000 in the hole. And these bales I'm making here ain't going to help nothing. Um, yeah, I think I finished the... Uh, with the wind or the rake here. Yeah, all that's finished. So I'm on to want to take the T8 back up to the market shop. And I'm going to see if I can take out a loan, which I, I doubt it. I don't know. I don't know if I took out the uh, Hagestag loan or not. I think I said that right. Um... My version here, you hit the end button. Whoa, sorry folks. You hit the end button, it pulls up this big old white square with a bunch of bank information and stuff. It's totally different, folks. Uh, Y'all seen it in my previous videos. And I hate sound down too, folks, but like I said, I tried that yesterday evening stuff, trying to get rid of it. I had a fire meeting. You know, like, you had a fire meeting this Thursday. I, I actually recorded this Monday, Monday morning, folks. So, but, you know, y'all see it on Thursday. But I, I record mine in advance. 
I try to get a couple of videos ahead just in case something like this happens. But it is currently Tuesday for me, Thursday for y'all. So remember that. Sometimes it gets confusing. All right. Let's see. Yeah, where's ATM? ATM's way down here. Let me see if I can borrow money this way. No, see, it's not going to let me borrow money through here because you can see both gray boxes here only let me go to the great the borrow money or repay money from here I, I think it's because of this mod right here I say I done borrowed one million dollars and I haven't paid that back so I don't think it'll give me any more Let's go like this. And let's see, it won't let me take out any more until this million dollars is paid back. So I'm actually a million and eighty seven thousand in a hole. So, uh, don't look like we're going to be getting a bailer anytime soon, uh, which that's going to suck. Uh, even if I reinstall the coon, uh, coon pack, it, it's still not going to give me a bailer because I have to rebuy, rebuy all that stuff. So, um... I can't remember if I'm leasing this pallet deal or not. Uh, let me go into the garage real fast, folks. I, I'm sorry about all this mess. But um, we'll get something straightened out here pretty soon, hopefully. Uh, I do know that... I hope I leased. No, I bought it. All right, this right here... Uh, I want to sell. I know I want about $250, but this here, I'm going to sell. Well, I'd probably get more if I drive that up to the selling point. And I really need every penny I can get right now. Um, this fuel trailer. Might even have to let one of our trucks go back or something. I don't know, not for sure. Well, I'd do something here, folks. I'll do it pretty quick, too. All right, um, I'm going to take this thing. And I hate to get rid of a Kentucky truck, but... Sometimes we just got to do what we got to do, folks, you know. I'm going to get rid of this here, too. Uh, let's see. Um, I, I'm trying to think. We don't have no sellage over. I don't know how much sellage is in the... Uh, oh, man, really? Uh I don't know how much silage is in the fragmenter down here. Uh, I think that's on this map. That's another thing. You get playing so many GoCrashers map, folks, you kind of forget what you got. What you have and what you do. Ah! Alright, that's twice. I guess I'm making up for, for the earlier part of the video, I guess. One thing about it, Kentucky truck is unstoppable. Only thing that can stop a Kentucky truck is a Kentucky truck. But we we need a baler because well I can mow some grass I guess. Oh this this coon pack 
and the Coon DLC done got me all bummed out on this one. I only know what's what. Sorry, sir. Parking. You go walking around. All right, that, that's good. Good. See, go to the garage. Y'all probably like what? They forty thousand. 40037 dollars is what they want to give it to me this way for and here I get fifty four thousand forty nine dollars big difference folks big difference probably spent a little bit of fuel coming up here but I'm thirty three thousand in the hole now instead of uh the other um, I'm going to go down here to the cows real quick, see how much sellage we got. I don't know if that would help out. I really don't want to start selling the equipment like that because I just got to buy it right back. The pallet maker, what is this for? Uh, yeah, see? Our, our spreader's gone too, or a fertilized spreader. It don't know what to do, folks. Don't know what to do. I don't know what else I had coming. Um, let's see here. First, I want to check out how much. Oh, yeah, folks. Ooh. Ooh. Lots of that. Um, where's my... Son? Oh, okay. 111,000 is digest eight. We, we got a lot of sullage. I can go sell sullage. I don't know how much it would make us, but... Um, yeah. First of all... I can't remember where I put the fertilized thing. Did I get a fertilized thing yet? Yeah, I did. It's right over there. We need to get a tanker up here. And, um... Yeah, I just need to get a tanker up here, get our digestate, and put over into our fertilizer bin. Y'all probably uh, don't even know what I'm talking about. I'm taking this, folks, because it's got 200,000 in this. Let's see, let's check our power food thing here. Kind of low on some of that grass. We got 150,000 in there. And how many cows we got left? Um, 21 cows, 237 pigs, 231 sheep. So I could sell some pigs right now and probably get out of debt. But um, let's go sell this sullage. Try to get out of debt and see if we can get a coon. Not a coon. That's a baler I'm talking about. Uh, it's a chrome baler. Oh, crap. Back over. There we go. Let that be loading up. And we, I'm going to show you this baler real quick. Uh, that we need to purchase. That's a that come on button. Right here, folks. 145000 And it's a Crone Baler and Wrapper. All right, this stuff here, see, it costs us an extra 30000 so 175000 for this Baler. So that, that's not bad because it makes bigger bales also. You can choose 4,000 liters, 5,000, or 6,000 liters. And uh, our semi truck flatbed over there will haul it. Yeah, it's over there. Do I have a tanker? I know I have a water tanker. Um, poor tractor got stripped. I got the big big bud disconnected. See, if I hook him up, see we got 
all that right now, so that's why I choose to leave them uh, undone. Uh, da -da -da -da. I don't want to sell some logs, it takes a while. I need to start these guys up. I forgot to do it right ago. My bad. I don't guess I have a tanker besides the water tankers. We're going to have to buy a tanker also, folks. So, yeah, that's one part about farming. If you want to grow, you just got to constantly buy. Uh, need to be planting. I guess we'll go ahead and get this guy cultivated. Might have to bring the planter over here and start behind him. I don't know why I took the planter up to uh, what was it, field 19, I think, because I ain't sprayed or anything over. Alright, we're back to the train, so. Almost full, guys, almost full. Um, I can't buy nothing, so, uh, this should get us out of debt, no problem. What is Sullage going for, anyway? Oh, yeah, I want to. See? Now, this is what gets me. This has been being off. Now, this is set to buy. I'm going to have to uh, start recording when, as soon as I log in and showing y'all this. That way y'all know that it's not me. After that, well, he just switched over to buy seeds and fertilize and get the cheap way out. Well, that's not what I'm doing, folks. I've got a serious mod issue. Like, good lord, no wonder I got a mod issue. Look how many mods I got. Y'all see the... I think I've done a video. No, I don't think I went all the way into the... Well, yeah, y'all did see my mod folder on that one video. Yeah, that's how many mods I got. Now, not all of them's active on the play, but... Pretty much most of them are on go, Chris. So I'm going to deactivate some of them. See what's going on. I guess I create now a folder called the X mods. I'll put them in there. Cause I hate to delete them. I might need it later on, you know. Folks, like I said, I want to apologize. Like I was saying earlier, I don't think I finished it. I might have. I don't know. But, you know, this is Tuesday for me. I started recording this Monday. And I think I left off from there. But I woke up this morning with a bad, bad headache. Mom and the kids went to the park. So I'm like, well, I'm going to record. And as you can see, it's almost 940 in the morning. I woke up about 7, I think, with a bad headache. Alright, this is what we're going to have to do. Yeah, I think I'll put a wall. All this weight, don't want to stop. I need to get straight here. And... Whoa, 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 stop, stop, stop. Too much at one time. Oh. Oh. I can't get off. Wait, that sounded wrong. I'm trying, folks. It just won't pull. It's sucking me into the la la land. No. But hey, our money's going. Down. Huh. Oh. I'm confused when I get some minus.
I'm out. Oh, Lord. I was going to say, not again. Now, I do not want this to stop. But I don't want that to happen again either. And it's going to. Well, folks, this might take a little bit. Um, <sighs> see, I, I really don't have really anything else to say right now so if I'm really disappointed in losing the coon coon pack which it probably just needed to be I think what it is the oh god don't stop don't stop and don't flip oh my god I'm on Come off of it. Come off of it. What a predicament. I think I should have stayed in bed, folks. <laughs> Actually, technically, I'm still in bed. I'm sitting on the side of the bed recording. And I think my problem is my sinuses. Oh, look at there. We're almost out of debt, and I still got like 100000 left in here. 108,000. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Look like it's still dripping. It might be full. Oh, I hope it's not full. It's full, folks. Oh, my God. All right. And instead of, well, I'm almost out of time anyway, the way it looks. Let me uh pause the recording right here. And I'm going to finish this out right here, okay? It's still moving. It's going to be slow. So I'm going to pause it right here. And I'll be right back in a second to y'all. Be a little while for me. Uh, we're going to try to get out of debt. And while this is doing this, I'm going to try to get something else going to make us a little bit more money. Might see if I can try to do a mission or something while this is working. So I'll be right back, folks. All right, folks. As you can see, I'm having technical difficulties. There we go. Did manage to get to thirteen thousand. But I also managed to mess this up. And this one this don't curve like it's supposed to be. You know, I probably could have dumped that on the outside right there. That'd be alright. Anyway, I want to show y'all something while this is doing that. Okay, never mind. I think I think I'm like Nance Stewart. I'm this or something. Because where I go, this was showing no fertilization right at all, none whatsoever. And now it's uh showing to be fertilized. All right, so 16 is fertilized. We're going to go right there real quick. Uh, if I hit the button right. Uh, Sean B. Canola. Is that what we want to plant? I'm not for sure. Yeah, because we ain't got no canola whatsoever. So yeah, let's plant a couple of fields of canola. All right, folks. Well, I guess uh, you close that lid. Close the lid. Close the lid. There we go. All right. Now you can proceed. Dude's done over here. I guess this was a uh, boo, and we just hired Jason. 
Um, I guess we're going to have to get us a fertilized buggy first out of this whole ordeal because uh, I forgot about it. That field rare still needs to be sprayed and yeah. And I have I have an idea. Don't know if it's going to work or not but yeah, it's one of those ideas. This thing's still full, folks. Uh, so probably gonna have to get a front bucket up here anyway. Probably wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, I'm pretty much gonna be over on my time on this, so I guess it's not much we can do this episode since it was wasted on the coon baler. But yeah. Um, trying to think. There's a front bucket. He's got a front loader attachment also, but that's not the one I need. Come on, where are you? Where are you? Right there you are, the cow edition. Let's see, disconnect this trailer. And we are going to dump this uh, Big Daddy Bronx thing off right here. Just going to park it in the middle. Just in case we... <gasps> oh, not that. That. I'm going to go over here and get this bucket. I thought I had something bigger, but I guess I don't. But anyway, folks, I am sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry for a messed up episode, but, uh, yeah, maybe next, next week it'll be better. Um, see, that's what I get for playing another map. I thought my chicken... House was over there. We need to collect these eggs real quick because we're losing. If you don't uh, collect them, they won't hold no more. So that's why you need to collect them every once in a while and let those eggs build up because they are money too. Matter of fact, I don't know how many eggs I got. I need to check that. But, folks, like I said, uh, if it wasn't for that coon pack, we could have done a little bit more. But at least y'all know that if you don't watch what you're doing, the mods can hurt you very badly. They can they can take out a complete game. Well, not take out the whole game, but you know, like it's the episode we're playing here. It it can wipe out the whole series, and it's a matter of installing a bad mod. Now, I don't think the mod was bad. I think what happened was, you know, the coon pack wasn't the coon pack. It was a coon baler. And um, the universal processing kit. Now, I'm not for sure. And please, if I'm wrong, somebody correct me. Because I want to know the, the issue on it. But I think those two together, it didn't, the coon... Baylor didn't like the processing kit because the universal processing kit does something you know you can take the box cutter and open up a uh, biogas I need to get this bucket up there at the bio, biogas plant to keep that thing running but anyway folks the uh, universal bailing or universal processing kit. Uh, ever since I installed it, I noticed that you can take a box cutter to your bales, open them up, and they'll spread out, and and the stuff like that. And other mods need it to work. And I think the coon baler uh, wasn't part of that. You know that they. 
I don't know, kind of like sun and night, you know. Water and fire, they don't, just don't mix. So I think that's what happened there. I'm going to go right here and clean the pigs real quick. Because, oh, there's the other. I thought I had two of these. I should have used that bucket there. It's a whole lot bigger. I'll probably take it up there to uh, do the sullage. And uh, that will be a lot better. Bigger bucket. A bigger bucket. So I can, uh, well, you know. All right. Uh, let's see. I'm just going to drop it right here. I'll come back, clean stuff up later. Right now, I got to get that money. What did I just do? The. I dropped the whole thing. Since this bucket's already attached. That's one reason why you need to separate them. But you never know. But all right, folks, I'm going to get off here. I'm out of time anyway. I right, say so I'm going to go bio gas, clean up this mess. Might take another load down there. Uh, might. I might just do some missions if they're working right. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. But I am thinking I'm going to clean this little pile up right here. And then I'm going to take a take a, 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 a rest of the day off. I just don't feel good. And, uh, yeah. Alright, folks. If you like what you saw, which I know you probably don't. But, uh, hit that like button, subscribe button if you want to. You don't have to. Uh... Just watching can be enough sometimes. Whoa. But anyway, yeah, I, I'm starting a new little thing there. Trying to get away from uh, uh, begging for subscribers and stuff. Uh, I want you to subscribe, but I want you to subscribe because you're wanting to. And only because you want to. You know what I mean? But, uh... Anyway, folks, thank you for watching, and I hope I'll see y'all next week here on Go Crest Valley PC Edition, and I will see you tomorrow, hopefully, on PV17V2, which is Pleasant Valley 17, version 2, which is, uh, well, I'll talk about that tomorrow and that, but it's going to be a V3 pretty soon, folks. We're going to have to make a lot of decisions, too. But anyway, we'll talk about that tomorrow's episode. And, uh, yeah, I'll see y'all later, folks. Y'all take care. Have a blessed day, a great day. And me, Tommy Miller, a.k.a. Mr. Blue, we'll see y'all later. Love each and every one of y'all. And like I said, thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'm out of here, folks. Bye. Oh, no. Yep, it's going to be a great day. <laughs> Bye, folks.